Homies, I am home. E. Um, boy is sick today. Wife is going into town to shop. She's dropping Ellie off at school right now, and then she's gonna go shopping and have some fun. Um, I have no information for y'all. I don't think. I guess I do. I guess I do. I can inform y'all some stuff. So Monday, yesterday, we had a day trip just to uh, Houston for immunotherapy. Um, I guess I'll sum up the radiation and chemo that we did on Thursday was our last day. And then Friday we got to come home, Saturday we had a good day, Sunday we had a good day, um, went to church and then I left back to Houston. So I, actually that's a lie, it wasn't a day trip, we did spend one night. Uh, Stephen and I went and hung out. Um, but as you can see, I'm trying to get the light right on my face, I'm pretty red. It doesn't look nearly as red on the camera. I'm very fried. Inside my nose is terrible. The um, I'm gonna speak some graphic words. The discharge and nastiness in my sinuses that I have to just flush out all the time is gross. It stinks, I smell like decay, it's terrible. This should go away in 10 days, I've read. So um, I stink really bad right now because there's a rotting tumor in my head um, and I'm breathing past it. It's gross, it's gross. Okay, so graphic part is over, kind of. Um, but my face is super radiated and it's gonna keep cooking for like a week or two, maybe three. And that's the craziest part about radiation is I'm not getting any more, but it's in my head working for another couple weeks, which is good. I mean, I want the tumor to go away and die. Um, but we started immunotherapy yesterday. That is a four week course of chemicals in my body that make, I think this is correct. I think that immunotherapy, because people keep asking me what it is. I think that um, immunotherapy basically takes my immune system and makes it attack certain proteins that my tumor consists of. Um, they found one protein, don't remember what it's called, and it was like 20% of the makeup of my tumor and it's one that they know immunotherapy will work against. So that's really good news. Um, I also have had a lot of y'all tell me that immunotherapy worked for your dad or you or, um, or somebody that you know and I've not had a single person say it didn't work. So that's really good. Good news for me to hear. Um, otherwise, that's about it. So four weeks, I am at home. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, four weeks until we start the next round of immunotherapy, and it's just the same thing, a one hour infusion, and we're done, back home for a month. So I get a lot of time at home. I'm still feeling great. I could complain. I've got a lot of side effects that are not fun at all, but if I'm at home, I can deal with those really well. I can't quite drive yet. Still have the double vision. It's getting better though. So. I don't know, guys, it's just promising. It's it's looking really good. Um, it's a scary tumor, like it's a super scary cancer. And uh, nobody knows really much about it, but the fact that radiation's working, the fact that I feel good, um, I don't know. Just, there's no point in being negative right now. What you doing, bud? We already got Easter decorations up. We are ready. What, are you taking your clothes off? No. You gonna get naked? No. All right, we're gonna get naked. Um, in a couple weeks, we do have to make a day trip for what I keep calling nuisance appointments. There's two, like a speech therapy class because they keep radiating, they were going to radiate this. I don't know why I said keep, I'm spaced out today. It's still morning time. Um, coffee's not quite kicking. Um, that's my excuse. So they were going to radiate this. They decided instead of radiating that, we're just going to try to attack this because it was so aggressive. And we'll worry about this later if we need to, which we probably won't. Lymph nodes and stuff is what I'm referring to in the neck. So I got lucky. I don't have any like sore throat or lack of voice or burned neck or whatever. It's just targeted right here. Um, what else was I going to say? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Y'all get to watch me think. <sighs> Buddy, what was that cough all about? He's like sick in every way. Look at him. He is naked. Good job, bud. Are you naked? Hey, do a dance. Naked dance, naked dance, naked dance. Good job, bud. Um, what was I gonna say? Immunotherapy. I don't remember. I don't remember. Oh, nuisance appointment. So I have speech therapy. I think I can cancel that actually because of the neck thing. That's why I got sidetracked because I don't think I need to go to that appointment, but it's on a day that we have to go anyways, so I might as well just go. Um, there's an audiology appointment to some, make sure my hearing is still good. Again, that's why I call them nuisance appointments. I can hear fine, kind of. I've never been able to hear fine. How about that? 
Um, and then we have uh, my main surgeon doctor that I have to see. She goes in and she debrides, I think is the word, where she just like, it's gross. More graphic stuff. Pulls out a bunch of junk um, from post-op stuff and growth and gross and gross. It's disgusting and painful. <laughs> uh, last time she was doing it, she was like, we can put you under, under anesthesia. And I was like, I'm a man, I can handle it. And she was like, are you sure? And I was like, yes. And I did handle it, but it was, it was rough. She made me cry a lot. Um, that's all I got. Um, I wanted to post a video yesterday. I actually wanted to post Ian's video yesterday about the stickers. A lot of y'all are super excited about those stickers and I am too. Thank you, Ian, for making us some stickers. I think it's awesome. I thought it was really strange at first when he picked the 007. I still think it's strange, but I love it. I think it's amazing. I'm sticking with it. I've always liked James Bond stuff and uh, I think it's cool. So that's gonna be my new lucky number seven, I suppose. Um, yep, MMGA 007, that's me. And we have nothing else going on this week. I probably won't be posting very many videos like I have been about like the daily updates and stuff because I'm not gonna have any updates other than, guys, I feel good, I'm hanging out with family. But projects, um, we can probably start doing some projects. I won't do like in-depth videos, like project videos like I used to, I don't think, for a while. Um, I probably will still be using my cell phone for a lot of stuff. I may, I really have been liking using iMovie to make these, just compile little short clips. Buddy, sit down on the couch, please. Sit down. Thank you. Um, but uh, to compile these clips, I've been using iMovie and it's super easy on your phone. So, I don't know. Uh, shout out to iMovie. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but uh, I will probably be doing some small projects here and there just because I feel good. We're gonna be doing stuff around the house. You probably won't get very many videos though, so I'm sorry. But we're gonna have fun. I just, I'm so happy to be home and relaxing and feeling good, really, really good. But I'm gonna go check this boy's diaper because normally when he gets naked, it's for a reason. And uh, we're gonna have a fun day playing together. Meds look like he's working pretty good. And uh, we'll go from there. Love you. see you soon. Bye.